PDP crisis. I must say that Atiku Abubakar is beginning to wake up to reality. Somna Sambu, welcome to the news and please subscribe to our channel. Nigerian political analyst Somna Sambu has opined that the presidential candidate of the People's Democratic Party, Atiku Abubakar, is beginning to wake up to realities. According to Somna Sambu, the issues on the People's Democratic Party would have been resolved long before now if the presidential candidates of the People's Democratic Party, Atiku Abubakar, listened to what Wiki has been saying. Sambo stressed that Nielsen Wiki seems to be insisting on his call for the resignation of a national chairman of the People's Democratic Party, Senator Iochia Ayo. Sambo made this remark during an interview just a few moments ago between the sixth and seventh minute when he was reacting to the lingering issues in the People's Democratic Party. You will recall that Governor Nielsen Wiki and some other major stakeholders and the People's Democratic Party have consistently called for the resignation of a national chairman of a party following the emergence of a northern presidential candidate. And the thing has not changed. You know, since when Wiki came out and was saying, you know, make I resign. I never hear any other thing. Like, it's not that he came today and said, make I resign. Then tomorrow he said, make the BOT chairman resign. Or he said tomorrow and come and say, oh, let the president can. No. All he has been saying, he has been very consistent and insistent in it. He has been saying, I you should resign. And it is because you cannot have a nothing presidential candidate and you have a nothing, what's it called? Nothing national chairman. It's not possible. I think one Ayu, who is wrongly placed in position. I was made a chairman due to the fact that presidential candidates, according to the People Democratic Party constitution, will come from the South. Now, Atiku, with his selfish ambition to become president, had defrauded the People Democratic Party constitution, moreover than hijacked the PDP ticket. Now he wants Ayi to resign his position to satisfy Atiku's selfish ambition. You look down on Ayi because he's not a full any man. Do you think Ayu is new in politics? Are you really serious? Who is fooling who? But Ayu is saying he will not resign now. And Atiku is saying no him too, they don't make him a what's it called presidential candidate. And I, I mean, Ayu and Atiku, they are actually allies. So what are we saying here? Tell me why Ayu, with all his experience and wisdom, decided to justice on Zuni. Exactly. If Ayu was saying uh, he doesn't want trouble, I don't want trouble, Lou, then why did he do that? Ha. As a chairman duly elected and, and out to protect his job, he should have startly stood for zoning. He lost his couple and with his, with his childish action after the presidential primary and has to go. Exactly. A northerner came out, emerged the presidential candidate. You are jumping up and down. Meanwhile, when it is fully, it is fully, <laughs> you are aware that he's supposed to go to the south. Okay? There's no two ways about it. It is a little too late for APC and PDP. That is the reason that both parties that destroyed this country with reckless stealing and cluelessness suspended their campaign indefinitely. Hmm. Okay? Those that the Lord hates, it shows the spanners of confusion in their midst. For Tenembu, to ask voters to sh shut up if expecting change from him is divine for the obedience movement. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think we do not want to win this coming election because of few individuals and his enemies within him. That doesn't want him to win the election. Put Ayu and the supporters and post the five PDP governors and the supporters who among them can give Atiku more votes. Atiku is not taking issues seriously. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh... Those of you who are not used to reading the Bible, I don't blame you. My happiness is that there are easy ways to find out anything these days. So if you want out, if you want out, if God made such remark, then he has the right to hate who I don't understand. That is very, this is not, this is not what we are talking about. I think we should go and continue his looted money in Dubai and Fulani to hand to Fulani is an aberration. Okay, Fulani to Fulani is an aberration. Hmm. Okay, on this note, we've come to the end of the news. We say thank you for.